All right, guys, this is the final part, guys. If you hear the noise, I'm eating my breakfast, okay? But yeah. Because uh, they guaranteed the Warner Bros. and David Zazzle were going to ask me, okay, hey, Ivan, if you want us to sell the rights to, 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 to you, if you, want, you, if you want us to sell the rights of, the, of our Matrix brand to you, obviously, you better give us a good, you, you better give us a good reason uh, why we should sell, sell off our assets. Are valuable assets, you know and and I give them, I I tell them, I tell them my plan. They're all shocked. Holy shit, Ivan, you, you have everything planned out. Yeah, I do. So Ivan, you want to tell that story in a three? Yeah, I want to tell this story in a three movie trilogy. It is a sequel to 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 to, to Bukowski sisters' original three movies that you guys made almost thirty years ago. Obviously, and what? And I am the new one, obviously. And I'm also going to create three, I'm going to make three games based off, I'm going to make three games based off, uh, I'm going to make three games based off, I want to make three games based off, uh, I'm going to make three games based off, um, based off what? Three games based off, um, my three matrix movies and i'm gonna put the unreal i'm gonna have the i'm gonna put unreal engine 5 technology into my three matrix games and she's looking at an unheard of revolution technology experience yeah and i'm also gonna sell merch so i have what do you think of the merch I'm, I'm gonna sell posters frame posters so you have a nice frame poster of me, VJ, and I don't know, Michael B. Jordan, all of them. And you have you have the frame ones and you have the, the the paper ones. And I'm gonna have it come with five mugs. For the fans, obviously. And I might give the fans an option to buy the, the toys and the t-shirts are an are an option to buy. You can buy some t-shirts and toys. Have nice matrix t-shirts and nice matrix t-shirts and nice nice toys. Nice Nice toys to, 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 I might not, I'm probably just going to stick to mugs and, uh, and, and posters to be honest. That's good enough. I don't need to sell toys. But I'll think about it. I might sell toys. See what happens. More money for me, VJ, right? Yeah. And I might perhaps consider doing, I might have the Path of Neo game and the Enter the Matrix game. I might have it remastered in PS6. You can do that. Release that before you release my game. I can do that. Put a good like eighty million dollars towards it, a hundred million towards it. You can have them remaster the games if you want, dude. You can remaster the games first. I'm most likely not going to do that. The the the, the, the Enter the Matrix and, and Path of Neo were released on Xbox, man. So it's very it's old it's old uh, technology, man. We're ready now. What this is what the fourth Xbox released. Yeah, the fourth Xbox release, it's, it's, it's very old technology, so there. I'm going to make my Matrix game based off my three movies. Matrix 1, Matrix 2, Matrix 3, so there. Yeah. Whereas Zanus, Zanus, I'm going to release the three games at the same time. So for Zayas, I'm going to make three games. For Zayas, I'm going to make three games, three different games, but they're going to be released in the box set. You can buy, you buy the whole bundle. Because I film the movies back to back, I can release the games. I can release the games, or you can release it year by year if you want. I'll release the game in a bundle, obviously. I release the whole game in a bundle. You get, you get volume one, volume two, volume three in a bundle. You sell the game for a good like. The three games, you sell the three games for a good like 220 bucks, 230 bucks for the three games. And Rabbit will do the walkthrough of all three games. So yeah, Rabbit will be will be will be doing like I don't know, he'll be doing a I'm gonna have him do a walkthrough for, 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 for all three games, man. So he's gonna be working for a good like two months around there. Which is if you pay him six hundred K, two and two two six hundred K for two months of work two months of work is a, is, 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 is a nice paycheck. It's a good deal for Rabbit. Yeah, you're looking at a long walkthrough, man. He's going to be doing Volume 1, Volume 2, and Volume 3 for Zanus. Because for Zanus, I don't want to keep the fans waiting. Just release, guys. Make all three games simultaneously. Release it in a bundle. 
Xehanus is a trilogy, you release the whole thing in a bundle. Whereas the Matrix games, you can release it, you can release it one, 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 one at a time. Take your time with the Matrix game. For a Xehanus game, don't rush the Xehanus game, make a good game, but I want it released, I want all three games released at the same time. Since there. Yeah, Ivan, what game do you think would be better? I don't know. The Zayn's game would be an amazing game, but I think the Matrix game might perhaps beat it out for the game, right? Like, if... Because the, the... The Zayn's movie will beat out the Matrix movie, but for the game, you can argue the Matrix game might beat it out. Because it's, there's nothing cool than seeing me as the one kicking ass, man. I'm the one, I'm kicking ass, and I'm fighting all these agents, you've got that Unreal Engine technology. But at the same time, you also have Takis fighting all the wolves... You have Tassatonius, you have all those characters. You also have the story of 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 of, of Zanus, Takis and Zanus. you look at an amazing game for that man. Unreal engine technology for 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 for, for Zanus too, yeah. Look at an amazing game, yeah man. You're looking at an amazing game. Yeah. So my Zanus game, I'll release the three games at the same time. For like two do a deal for, I don't know, each game is 70 bucks each. So 70 times 3, you can sell it for a good 210 for the three games. The world can buy it, obviously. Or if you don't want to buy it, spend 210 and Because you know, there's some people who don't own PlayStations, right? So if you don't want to pay, I don't know, 400 or 500 bucks, 600 bucks for PS6, and you don't feel like paying 210 for the game, you can watch Rad Brad's walkthrough. If I hire him, I might not. We'll see what happens. I most likely will hire him. You can watch Rabbit's walkthrough on, 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 on my website for free. I won't charge you for it, since there. So for those of you around the world who are not really game people, who don't who are not really a big fan of playing games and you don't feel like paying like 500 600 bucks for a PlayStation 6, obviously, you can just watch Rabbit's walkthrough on my website. And you get the game, you get the, the which you guys will. Yeah, I'm not even though I'm not a big fan of games, obviously, I I, I'm a, I wanna watch Ivan's fucking game. See what it's like to see Ivan in a fucking game. Yeah, you play as me, you play as VJ. You don't... In the game, you will not play as Lithia in the game. You could have... You could play as Lithia a little bit in the game if you want, but... You'll be playing as, like, me, Tassitonius, Cassius, Papari, Sirius, Joe. Half scenes where you can play with different characters. But I'm the main character of the story, obviously, since I am. For the major scheme, I will be the main character of the story, obviously, but you're also going to be playing as, as VJ. You, know, you have you play as VJ for some scenes, you play as Michael B. Jordan, you play as Brie Larson, you have some scenes where you play as different people. You, know you have a scene where you have to deliver the package to the guy, and you can't get caught by the agents. And 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 and, 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 and the cops, yeah, you have you have inter something interesting like that for the game to make it more interesting. Some Zara. Hence why the Matrix brand is better off in my hands. Because the moment I purchase the rights off, the moment Warner Bros. sells their rights for the Matrix to me, which they, they'll gladly sell it off, obviously. You know what I'm saying? Uh, my, my Matrix brand will become bigger than Star Wars. As you're looking at crazy buzz for that Matrix movie and the Matrix game, you look at something crazy, man. Crazy buzz for the Matrix movie. Ivan, mean, how crazy? You're looking at something like crazy, man. Like, like Just as crazy as Zanus. You know what I'm saying? Just as crazy. Because you have... Because for, for, for Xanus, you have Eric F. Dell himself, obviously. For the Matrix, you have the agents. And you have me, the one kicking ass. That builds buzz. Yeah, man. VJ kicking ass like Trini. Yeah, it's going to build buzz. And don't forget, the Agent Smith in my major trilogy is going to be freakier than the one than the one even in the originals. Because I'm going to make my Matrix move for 14+. plus, 14-year-olds and up, right? Yeah. The Matrix movies were PG-13. I want to ask John, John, like, you think I should make the Matrix movies PG-13 or 14 plus? I don't know, Ivan. Do you, I, yeah, I want the agents to be a bit darker, and I want them to be a bit more blood. 
They say shit, bitch, and ass in it, but there's no swearing in it. There's no nudes. It's all PG-13 nudes like you got for the majors. Oh, I mean, 14 plus is fine. It's only, it's th PG-13 is for 13 and up. 14 plus is for 14 and up. Yeah. 14 plus is for 14 and up. It's, it's, it's Kids can still watch, obviously. But it's a little darker, my, my Matrix trilogy. So I'm saying, huh? Whereas the Spider-Man Miles Morales trilogy, I'll make that PG-13. I don't have to make it 14 plus. I'll make that PG-13, the Spider-Man Miles Morales franchise. If I purchase the right to Spider-Man Miles Morales. My plan is, if I do the three Matrix movies, after I do the three Matrix movies, I might perhaps do my four movies that I want to make. But I'm gonna most likely I'm gonna be hiring different actors for that. Some singer, or I might purchase the rights of Hollywood for the Spider-Man Miles Morales franchise. For a good like four hundred million dollars, they'll gladly give me the rights for a Spider-Man Miles Morales brand. Guys, I don't want to purchase your Marvel brand. I just want to purchase the rights off your Spider-Man Miles Morales brand and all and all, and all the villains in, in Spider-Man Miles Morales. I want to purchase the rights. Of, okay, Ivan, how much you would have pay me? I would have pay you a good four hundred million dollars for it. I'm worth a billion. No, I'm not going to pay you a billion. You ripped me off. He's not. It's not. The Spider Miles Morales brand is not worth a billion dollars. Like, you know I'm saying, you guys did what? You did a game. You did a Spider Miles Morales game on PS5, obviously. And you did that, 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 what? That animated movie that wasn't that big of a hit. I'm not going to give you a billion dollars. You ripped me off. I'll, for a good $350 million around there, I'll give, I'll, I'll give you that. For $350 million, I can easily purchase the rights for the Spider Miles Morales franchise. Right? So my phase what? My phase one will be Zanus. My phase one will be Zanus. And then if I make the Matrix franchise, what I'll do is phase one is Zanus, and then phase two is my Matrix franchise. And then I move on to phase three. So I'm saying. So the moment I make Zanus, that ends phase one. My phase one is over. I'm now moving into phase two. And, and and I'll do my Matrix franchise. So with John Favreau and Nathaniel are hard. I will I will have them work on my Zanus project, my three Matrix movies. And I might have them work in maybe one one movie after that. And after that, the journey ends. They're they're going to retire them, and I'm going to hire a new team because they're all they're looking at they're looking at about what twenty years about around there around that time right eighteen twenty years. I'll retire them after that. I'm going to have to have this big talk with John Nave. Guys, you know what I'm saying? Guys, yeah, yes, Ivan. You know what I'm saying? Okay, John, you know what I'm saying? They already know it. Somebody goes, okay, guys, I want to make my last Horror Zanus movie first. After that, I'm thinking of doing these four movies, or I'm thinking of purchasing the rights off the Matrix brand. Ivan, right, what are you thinking of for your Matrix brand? Yeah, I'm thinking of doing a sequel. Like, like, Keanu Reeves is the one, or like, you're the one. No, no, I'm the one, and VJ is my lover, and then Michael B. Jordan's a great grandson of Morpheus. Holy shit, that sounds like a sick movie, you know what I'm saying? Ivan, like, how are you going to do that? They already made the Resurrection movie, Ivan. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to erase it from the face of the map. Are you sure they're going to agree to do that, Ivan? Yes, they're going to agree to do it. I'm going to get them to agree to do it. You know what I'm saying? So you want to erase from canon? Yes, I want to erase from canon. It cannot be sold anywhere worldwide. Online, retail stores, Amazon, it's deleted. It's gone. I don't want it a part of canon, so there. Okay, Ivan, what are you thinking of for your Matrix story? They already know it. Somebody knows. I'm like, okay, right, okay, John, Dave, this is my idea for the Matrix stories. <laughs> and they're all like shocked, like, holy shit, Ivan, that sounds like a masterpiece, Ivan. Yo, Ivan, that sounds even better than your Great Escape story. And I tell him, Ivan, what's your idea for your four movies? And I tell him, I'm like, holy shit, Ivan, you're gifted. All your movies sound like masterpieces. I'm like, yeah, guys, I'm born with a gift, man. I want to tell a good story. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, Ivan, even though that Great Escape movie sounds amazing, it does not look, it does not sound as good as that Matrix story, man. You was the one in the and Agent Smith kicking ass. You're kicking ass, Ivan, in the Matrix. VJ kicking ass like Trini. Like, oh, man. Like, uh, Ivan, your Matrix story will even rival your Zayn story, Ivan. Yes, it will. Look at a masterpiece. Whereas the Great Escape story will not rival Zanus. Like, it'll be a good movie, but Zanus will beat it out, man. Because the Great Escape movie is just, we can't find Jaws, we work for this company, we found us dirty, we're on the run, we're kicking ass. Amazing story, obviously, but it's not as good as that, that Matrix story. The one is born, the Agent Smith is reborn in, 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 in human adult form. You know what I'm saying? You get the life of the one, and he, he dies in the end, he's, and he's reborn, he's the one, he's kicking ass. The third movie, he has a beard, he's a press, and he fights Smith once and for all. He's looking at amazing, a masterpiece, man. Fucking masters of a story, yeah. Man. 
And John Favreau's name will be shocked. Like, holy shit, I'm in your creative. Yeah, I'm a creative, guys. You may be more intelligent than me, guys, but I'm very creative. I'm born, God gave me a gift, man. I'm, I'm, I'm creative. I have all these pictures in my mind. I'm able to just tell a good story. Because I'm that creative. Yeah, man. I'm not that intelligent, obviously. I'm very creative. But even though I'm creative, I need help, man. I need, I need those guys to help me, obviously. I need some help. Because there's sometimes, even, even though I'm creative, there's sometimes where I'm stuck, obviously. I need some help. I need, you need, I need help, obviously, since there. So let's talk about my Matrix story before I end this video, you guys. I keep saying this. So in the Matrix, the Wachowski sisters, they wrote in the script, Morpheus says the one was born in the Matrix. But when you watch the movie, Keanu Reeves wakes up in the real world, and he has he's in, 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 he wakes up in the real world, obviously, in that machine place, obviously, in his human form in the real world, obviously. So how was he born in the Matrix? My, my idea is you have this, like, seed, obviously. So the one is born just like a human being is born, but 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 he 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 doesn't have any parents. He has the, the seed, the seed, just like just like human beings have sperm. Obviously, the sperm is a seed, and the seed, the sperm, the sperm grows in, in, in a woman's womb, obviously, into an actual baby. Something similar to like that. You have this seed, which is similar to like a sperm, obviously, and it it forms into in, in, into what in, into 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 what into into a baby, in in the real world, obviously. And the moment the baby is fully formed, obviously, the machines are aware, obviously, they put the, 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 the plug connection on the back of the baby's head, obviously. And the moment they plug, they plug, they, they, the moment they plug, what? They plug, they plug on the back, they, 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 they plug the plug onto the baby, obviously. Something happens in the matrix, you get this electricity, and the, the body of the baby is, is, takes form in the matrix, and the baby is born in the matrix. And that's what the cost sisters meant by the one being, that's the best example to, to, to explain how the one is born in the Matrix. I can't think of any other example, guys. Yeah, Ivan, I can't. Yeah, I, yeah Ivan, that's, 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 that's accurate. Yeah. So you have this seed that, I don't know, the seed goes in like the goo, whatever it is. And the, the baby is is, 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 takes form as a baby. So you have this biological birth of the one. And the, in, 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 in the Matrix, it's, it's more of, it's more of a non-biological birth. The electricity takes place. And 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 then the the body of the one is forming, and the baby. And once the baby is born, he the baby cries. You see what I'm saying? And you have something like elect electricity, and the body of the major, the, the body of Agent Smith, the virus of Agent Smith's body forms, in full adult human form. He's like, I'm back, and he looks into the sky, and you get like two flashes of lightning, flashing, and then two more agents form, and they clinch their fist. You know what I'm saying? He's like, we're back, Smith. You know what I'm saying? Any anomalies? No anomalies. The last anomaly, the name was Neo, deceased, a hundred years ago. Are you sure there's no anomalies? I'm saying, and like, no anomalies. And a couple hours later, a day later, the, the one, the baby one is born. I might do a thing where an, a day later, the one is born, or something like that. Either a couple hours later, or a day later, the one is born into the Matrix. He's born in the real world, he's also born in the Matrix. Because he's half man, half machine. But because he's human, obviously, he, he he's born as a baby, obviously. So when he's when he's born, he's truly born as a baby. But he has a special birth, obviously. The seed is 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 is, is created, and and, 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 and. I mean, where does the seed come from? I don't know. The seed comes from the essence of the the spirit of the one, obviously. The spirit of the one, obviously. The seed comes from the spirit of the one. See what I'm saying? The spirit of the one. Where is the spirit? I don't know. The spirit of the one is still alive, obviously. And, and, and the seed comes from the spirit of the one. And, and, and it goes into the goo or something like that. And the baby is born in, 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 in the real world. And the machines are aware of the baby. And then they plug. the moment they plug him, he's now born in the Matrix. And something happens. You have this electricity and the body of the baby is forming in the Matrix. Obviously. So I have new... You're thinking of... So the one is born through this seed. Yeah, the one is born... The one is born just like any other human baby, but he has a special birth. Obviously, he doesn't have any parents, but the, the, he's born by the, the, he's born by this seed. The seed grows into an actual baby in the real world. And that's a human side of the one. And the moment he gets plugged, the machine side of him or his mind, the mind side of him in the Matrix is born. In in but but because he, he in the Matrix you take full human form too. The baby is also born in the Matrix too. That's the only that's the accurate way to say it. Obviously, since I'm saying. 
Yeah, so you guys, it's electricity and 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 and, 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 and the body, the virus is for, forms in human form, and Agent Smith is reborn in a, in a full human adult form, obviously. So because the Agent Smith is not human, he's not born as a baby. He doesn't transform into a baby. No, he transforms into his full human adult self, obviously. You see what I'm saying? And he never ages, right? You can do that. He never ages, obviously. And what? And, 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 whereas me as the one, I age because I'm human, so I'm saying, or was Agent Smith never ages. And the moment he's born, you get, like, two lightning flashes, and you see, you see the two agents form. They're, they're human form forming, too. The virus is forming in, in human form, and it forms into two adult agents. And they're behind Agent Smith, and they clinch their fisk. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, what do I do? I don't know. I'm thinking of having Smith, he's naked or something like that, or he's naked, or he, he, he forms with clothes. I don't know. I'm gonna have to talk. Hey, do you want Agent Smith enough to be naked? Because the one, one, the one, when the baby one is born, he's naked. Obviously, he's he's naked in the in the real world. He's also naked in in in, in, in the Matrix because he's a, he's a human being. Obviously, the one. But but the agents. I don't want to copy Terminator. You see what I'm saying? I don't want to copy. Oh, I mean, you're kind of copy. I don't want to copy Terminator. But what do you guys think? You think the, the when the agents are created. When Agent Smith comes back and, and his body takes form, you think it's cool if he takes form in, in his, with his clothes, or he's naked, and he and he he's naked obviously, and then he 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 puts on he finds his clothes obviously, he finds his clothes obviously. You can do a thing where Agent Smith, when he, he's naked obviously, and he goes to the store, he goes to the store obviously. He's I'm gonna need a suit, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna need a suit. I'm saying, are you gonna pay for that? He's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like are you gonna pay for that? And he kills the guy and he gets the suit. You can do that to make it interesting. But I don't want to copy Terminator. You see what I'm saying? I don't want to copy Terminator. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. But the question is, when the one is born, obviously in the Matrix, obviously, and the electricity forms his human flesh, and he's now a baby. He's crying. Where is he? Is he? Is he in the parking lot? Is he in a car? You know what I'm saying? Is he? Is he what? Yeah. I don't know. But my idea is when, when I'm saying so whenever the three agents Agent Smith is is is, is reborn in in, 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 in in a new physical body, obviously. The virus Smith, electricity takes place and the the body of the of of, of Smith is forming in, in full adult body form and he looks up and you get like two lightning flashes. And some people in the Matrix see what the fuck's going on. And something like Terminator, obviously, and the two agents form. You know, something scary like Terminator. You get this song. It's like intense music. And they get they clinch their fist. And Agent Smith's like, I'm back. You know what I'm saying? It's like, any anomalies? No anomalies. The last anomaly, is the name was Neo. Deceased. You know what I'm saying? Just like five, five previous anomalies before him, you know what I'm saying, you could do something like that, to make it more interesting, obviously, are you sure there's no anomalies, no anomalies, and a couple hours later, the one is, the one is, the, the one is born, in the, uh, in, 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 in the Matrix, obviously, so the moment Ma Agent Smith comes back to the Matrix, obviously, the Sentinels blink, and they're, 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 it affects us, the, the machines in the real world, obviously, and everyone's on, like, what the fuck is going on? Something must have happened in the Matrix, and they 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 knew that it was a, there was a glitch going on. The glitch happened in the Matrix, obviously. A glitch happened in the Matrix, obviously. And the Oracle and the Architect normally panic, and they make a deal with the machines. I have how they meet with the machines. I don't know. I don't know, but they they meet with they they meet with the machines. The machines meet with the Oracle. The best way to make it work is you have the machines panic in the real world, obviously, and and and, 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 and the Oracle and the Architect panic. And they make a deal with the machines. You remember that God machine? Yeah, they make a deal with that God machine. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Obviously. You know what I'm saying? And you, I might have the machine. He's like, yeah. He's like, we, we, we should, we, we, we should, we should, we should, we should, we should have what? We, we should, we, should, we, 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 we underestimate Smith's power. Neil told me. A hundred years ago, Neil told me the Agent Smith has grown beyond, our, beyond, beyond, beyond our control. Yes, the Agent Smith grew beyond Neil's control, obviously, and the and Neil said you cannot stop him, but I can. But he and what if and if you fail, I won't. And Neil failed, obviously. He saves on, obviously, but he he failed. And the, and, and, and the machines, 
Agent Smith grew beyond the, 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 the machine's control, and the machines and the Oracle Norm underestimate Smith, obviously. And Neil let Smith cock as a to, but Neil, but Smith duped him. Smith duped the machines. His spirit still lived on. He was alive, yes. He's alive, obviously. Yeah. So the the, the agents, the the, the, the the machines, Smith the Smith grew beyond the, the the machines' control. Obviously, they did not know that Smith uh, spirit lived on. Obviously, he duped them. Obviously, since so Neil made a mistake. There. He thought he could defeat Smith, but he couldn't defeat Smith. He let Smith cop as a wand to him, and because of that, the spirit of Smith still lived on. That's why the virus was able to come back into the Matrix, obviously. And the moment the virus of, 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 of Smith comes back in the Matrix, something happens in the world, and the Sentinels are aware. Because the Asians, the Asians control the Sentinels, obviously, right? They're aware, and everyone in Zion's panicking, obviously. What the fuck's going on? And the Oracle makes a deal with the machines, and it's like, okay, we must, you know I'm saying, the only one who can stop the Agent Smith is the one. He said, the one, the one is dead. Neil died a hundred years ago. A new one must be reborn. You know what I'm saying? A new one must be reborn, obviously. And when the moment the Oracle, Oracle and the Architects say that, something happens, something happens in the real world, obviously. A seed is formed, and the, the seed, the, the, you get this seed, and the seed creates, the, the seed is, 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 uh, is what? The seed, um, um, the seed what? The seed grows into a baby, obviously. And that baby is the one. Natural birth, it's, 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 it's the same thing like a natural birth, except it's taking place supernaturally, obviously. He doesn't have any parents, but the seed is like a, forming like a sperm into a baby. But very, very quickly, in, in, like in, in, in a couple hours span of time. And you get the baby growing, obviously, in that goo, whatever it is. And the, 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 the machines put the, 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 the plug connection on the back of his head. And the moment they plug him into the matrix, obviously, the, something you get this electricity in, in, in the matrix electricity in the matrix and the body of the one is being formed into a baby obviously and the baby's crying and then someone finds the baby obviously and they put him in the adoption place so right after once that you get that scary scene where like smith smith's body forms the virus of smith forms into full adult human form obviously and you get this like two lightning strikes behind him and two Big, uh, two agents, because agents come in threes, right? The two agents form behind him, obviously. They're the anomaly. You know, the anomalies. Is there any anomalies? No anomalies. The last anomaly was Neo, deleted. You know what I'm saying? Last anomaly was Neo, deceased a hundred years ago. You know what I'm saying? Ha ha ha. Smith is laughing. Ha 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 ha. He's deceased and I'm back. You know what I'm saying? He's like, he's like laughing. I'm saying, Are you sure there's no anomalies? No anomalies. And they walk. And, and you get the scene with the Oracle meeting the machines and people packing his eye, and you get the the, 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 the one being being uh, created in, in the biological form in the real world through the seed, obviously. And the moment the, the, the machines plug the thing on the back of his, the plug, plug the plug on the back of his head, obviously, the, you get electricity and the, the baby of the one is born in the Matrix. You get his body forming, and, and, but his body's forming through the electricity. Whereas in the real world, his body's forming through the seed. So you get the biological birth and the machine birth, pretty much. Symbolism of the half man, half machine. You see what I'm saying? So the body of the baby is formed in the matrix through electricity. It's not formed through, uh, through, 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 uh, because electricity represents like machine, right? The body is formed through electricity in the matrix. Whereas in the real world, it's formed through a seed because it's, he's, he's, he's biological, it's a biological birth in a matrix in, in, in the real world. Whereas in the matrix, it's, 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 it's a, it's a, it's a machinery birth, but the, the 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 one is human, obviously. Hence, why he's born. He's he's a baby. Whereas the, Agent Smith and all of them are viruses. Hence, why what? Hence, why whenever the virus forms, takes form in, in, into human takes takes form, obviously in a human in a human body, obviously they 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 they, they what? They're they're full adult human beings because they're not human, obviously. Agent Smith never ages. He does. He you know what I'm saying. He doesn't what. He, he, he forms into a full adult you know, as a new man, obviously. Same essence, but he's a new man. Whereas the one is actually born as a baby because he's human, obviously. See what I'm saying? And, 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 and so, so when I, the moment Agent Smith arrives in the Matrix, obviously, he's on back, and the two agents are take form take form through electricity behind him, obviously. The one is also born a couple a couple hours later who's meant to defeat him, obviously. Look at that masters of a story, yeah, man. The one is born. The one is born, obviously, to what? To defeat Smith, obviously. 
but the, the agents, Smith and those two agents, don't know the one was born yet. Anyways, they don't know the one was born, obviously. And by the third movie, I have a beard, and I'm and I, I have epic battle with Agent Smith, and I, and I defeat him. Obviously, look at an amazing story, a masterpiece, Gammon. So I, you kind of want, I wanted to have some Terminator vibes, but don't copy Terminator. No, it's not Terminator, but you have some Terminator vibes. You know what I'm saying? Um, 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 Agent Smith is ignorant. He does not know the anomalies. He 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 does he does not. He thinks there is no anomalies in the Matrix. The two agents think there's no anomalies in the Matrix. You know what I'm saying? But the, the, the anomaly is... But they find out eventually that he's the one, obviously. And they kill him, obviously, in the end. In the end, in the end of the first movie, they kill him. They kill him, obviously. And this time, when they kill the one, it's a, it's, 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 it's a sad death, man. They, 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 I don't know. Agent Smith, he beats the shit out of me. I'm bleeding. He beats the shit out of me. My eyes are like, my eyes, I have like black eye and he's beating the shit out of me. And at the end, he like shoots me like five, six times. And I, blo I die a bloody death, man. And I come back to life and brand new man. I kick ass on the one. Something crazy. Oh, I mean, how, I don't know, think something very bloody and disturbing, man. Something even more disturbing than me. That way you create a more powerful story. And I, I resurrect a life and I'm the new man. I'm, I'm kicking ass on the one. What kind of amazing story, yeah, man. What kind of masterpiece. Anyways, if this video, guys, um, I'm going to upload this video. You guys will watch this video when I go down. 10, 15 minutes from now. And I'll enjoy the show with you guys. It's Ivan Amer. I'm signing out. Peace.